And this morning, the area is seeing that first round of a wintry mix as we are all under a winter weather advisory. It'll expire at noon, but another winter weather advisory goes into effect later today into tomorrow morning for that second round to bring us freezing rain, snow and sleet. Even from this morning, slippery roads are possible, especially on unsurfaced areas or are untreated, I should say, and those overpasses and bridges. Here's what exact track is bringing right now. We saw bulk of that activity moving through early. It's slowly starting to move out, but there has been some freezing rain mixed in, so you may run into those slick spots. Give yourself a little extra time commuting this morning, and luckily we do get plenty of dry time before that second round moves in. Here's what uh, future track brings us heading into the rest of our day today. Lots of dry time, lots of cloud cover before we see that second round moving in. In fact, this afternoon, afternoon, some of us may see some freezing drizzle before we see more widespread activity moving in this evening overnight. It takes over with a lot of us seeing that wintry mix. Now we have a better chance of seeing freezing rain, but as the temperatures start to climb, we'll slowly start to see some snow and sleet mixing in early into tomorrow morning. Regardless, it looks to stick around for a better half of the morning on Tuesday, bringing for some slippery conditions into your morning commute. We then slowly start to see that activity tapering off, but those further to the north will see these snow showers and even that wintry mix stick around for the longest. Really going to try to exit by the early afternoon and then the entire area does stay dry. So in terms of what to expect, we'll see that dusting of snow early, a lot of it already out with freezing drizzle into the afternoon. Then freezing rain starts to move in as we then see some snow and sleet also moving in and mixing in as the temperatures start to climb. But all of that will slowly start to exit as we see improvements by the early afternoon tomorrow. As far as today goes, watch for those slick spots this morning. A lot of that activity moving out will then stay dry until freezing drizzle joins in until we see more widespread activity. And from that entire wintry mix that moves in overnight, accumulations are going to be quite slushy, but a lot of it will just fall under an inch. So not expecting a lot to accumulate, but the slick conditions will lead to those hazards. We won't be done just yet when it comes to that active weather. Even after all that moves out early Tuesday afternoon, rain showers will move back in early Wednesday into Thursday and localized flooding is possible with that snowpack slowly starting to melt. And while your temperature is staying either at or slightly above freezing, moving forward. We're dry for the end of the week and your weekend with plenty of cloud cover overhead. And in your most accurate 10 day forecast, we'll actually see some more sunshine next week with those temperatures also staying in the mid 30s, Manny.